Hey guys, Amp here, bringing you another Affinity Designer tutorial. And in this tutorial, we will be going over the uh, export function and uh, the export slice tool. So, um, the first thing you need to do is uh, gather your image, and uh, you kind of want to be this have this image be close to done. And uh, what you're going to do is you're going to come up to uh, the slice persona or the export persona and choose the slice tool. And uh, you can choose any number of different slice patterns that you want. You can have uh, an unlimited number of slice. And uh, the slice panel is uh, extremely useful. It tells you uh, the dimensions of your slice and the format the file will be uh, exported as. So in this case, a PNG file. Um, and uh, it's going to add a, uh, another panel over here, which is the slices panel. And uh, once you have your selected image and you are uh, desire to slice, you can come over here and uh, export them individually, or you can even come down here and choose the export selected, which will export all of the uh, checked items over here. Uh, now you can also choose uh, the slice selection tool and uh, adjust the dimensions and uh, there's a bunch of different uh, things you can add to your slices and uh, you can even choose the times uh, or the different uh, resolutions of your slices. Uh, this tool is extremely useful uh, if you have a busy design and have certain aspects that you may want to use in different projects or uh, you want to cut down on the project and you only want a certain po po uh, portion of the uh, project, uh, it's really useful for uh, comic artists you, if you want just a single panel. Um, but uh, that's the slice tool. Uh, it's really quite a basic tool. In the expert persona, there is really only uh, three different tools or four different tools here. So um, there's not a lot to do. But uh, that's the slice tool. Uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for more uh, Affinity Designer and Affinity Photo tutorials.